I'm looking for Eric. Do you know where he is? Oh, I wouldn't waste my time if I were you chasing after him. <sighs> Stephanie. You and Eric came together to help your daughter through a very difficult time, but you can't pretend you thought the marriage would last. Excuse me? You couldn't have been surprised when he asked you for the divorce. He didn't ask me for a divorce. Of course he did. Last night. I, he, he talked to you last night. Well, we talked about a lot of things all night long, but he... Well, we didn't talk about divorce. Matter of fact, Eric and I are closer than we've been in a long time. So, you and Eric are closer than ever. We shared something rather incredible, yes. You're either deluding yourself or you're lying, and I don't know which is sadder. Look, if you don't want to believe me, ask Eric for yourself. He'll tell you the same thing. Felicia's death may have brought you two closer together, but Eric is committed to a future with me now, Stephanie. Well, who's deluding themselves now? It is a fact. He asked me to marry him. We're engaged. Look at it, Stephanie. It's a beautiful ring. It's an engagement ring. Then why aren't you wearing it? Because Eric didn't want to hurt you. Or Felicia. I mean, he couldn't deny his daughter's dying wish. But he couldn't deny his love for me either. Well, it certainly seems to me that he wanted to hide it. Eric gave me this ring the day that he agreed to marry you because he wanted me to know that his love for me was real and that his marriage to you it's just a show. Things have changed. Yes, they have. Felicia is gone, and Eric is free to move on with his life. Is that why you've had such a hard time accepting Felicia's death? Because you know that once you do, you have to let go of Eric. Oh, please spare me this five and dime psychoanalysis. You do Mrs. Forrester, I hate to bother you at work, but Oh, I'm sorry. You have company. Oh, that's all right. She was just leaving. But uh, keep your eye out. She has an eye for younger men. Oh, this conversation isn't finished. Oh, yes, it is right now. Goodbye, Jacqueline. Dr. Ramirez, is something wrong? Everything's all right. Felicia's still improving. Oh. Is there something else you wanted to talk to me about? Yes. It's the rest of your family. They think Felicia's dead, and it's killing them. You can't keep this a secret any longer. 